Welcome to this video. In our previous video, we started to model deep drawing process as an asymmetric problem. In this video, we will continue to model this problem using Abacus standard solver. Solving problems which contain contact is really difficult by Abacus standard. In this video, we will explain how to increase the chance of convergence of the solution in these types of the problems. We define contact gradually and introduce it step by step to increase our chance of convergence as we will explain later. To simplify the contacts of this problem, at first we introduce a small distance between punch and blank to reduce the parts in contact at the beginning of the solution. For this purpose, we translate the punch by 0.5 millimeters. Then we can go to the step module and define a step for this problem. We define several steps to introduce contact gradually to this problem. In the first step, we only introduce contact of all the parts without any load. We define a step by the name contact and the type is static general and nonlinear geometry is on and this step can be started with moderate initial increment. In this step, we have no load. In the next step, we introduce contact between blank and die and blank holder by very small movement of the blank holder toward the blank. We introduce contact between holder and blank and blank and die in one step. The initial increment size of this step is set to be 0.1. After introducing the contact between blank and holder and blank and die, we introduce the contact between punch and blank in the next step. In this step, the punch will be moved toward the blank and the contact between these two parts will be solved during the Abacus standard process. As in the real process, the movement of the holder is controlled by a force. In the next step, we delete the movement of the holder and apply a concentrated force to the holder to control its position during the process. For this purpose, we create another step. This step is also a static general and we use similar setting for this step too. Please note that all of these steps were only for defining the contact and increasing the chance of convergence of the problem. In the next step, movement of the punch, which is the main part of this process, is modeled. This step will be the hardest step of this problem and we use a smaller initial increment size and we increase the maximum number of increments and decrease the maximum size of the increment to increase the chance of convergence in this step which is really complicated contains lots of contact and solving it in abacus standard may be difficult before leaving the step module we also request a history output which contains reaction force of punch this force can be used in choosing the appropriate machine for forming this part. We have a set for punch and choose it and then request reaction forces for this set. In the visualization module, we can plot the computed forces related to the punch. 
Thank you guys for watching this video. Please watch our next videos of this series for continuing the modeling of this problem. If these videos are helpful for you, please let us know by a like, a comment or a subscribe. See you in next videos.